<laughs> well, um, he's an outlier. He no longer belongs to the IPCC, and he is way outside uh, the scientific consensus. Uh, but Meredith, part of the part of the challenge the news media has had in covering this story is the the old habit of taking the on the one hand on the other hand approach. Uh, there are still people who believe that the Earth is flat, but when you're reporting on a story like the one you're covering today, where you have people all around the world, you don't take you don't search out for someone who still believes the earth is flat and give them equal time and the reason the IPCC was awarded the Nobel Peace Prize the thousands of scientists who make up that group have for almost 20 years now uh, created a very strong scientific consensus that is as strong a consensus as you'll ever see in science that the climate crisis is real human beings are responsible for it uh, the results would be very bad for the United States and for the entire world community all human beings unless we do something about it and there is still time to solve it